If you have an Android device that's not made by Huawei, you should be able to root it some way or another. A good place to start is to head over to the first link down in the description below and check if your phone or tablet is listed there. If it's not, then odds are against you in the possibility of rooting your phone. The main steps to rooting your phone is to first find a way to unlock the bootloader of the phone. Some devices have it easy. You just boot to the bootloader and issue the command fastboot oem unlock and that's it. Some other devices have it the hard way and require more steps. But the main goal is to unlock your bootloader. Once that's done, the second step is installing a recovery. Some phones also have it the easy way and require you to issue the command fastboot flash recovery and then the recovery of your choice. Some other phones don't have a recovery partition and require you to directly boot to a temporary recovery using the fast boot boot command and after that you can use a recovery zip file to make the recovery install itself permanently on your device. After installing the recovery, it's all about installing a zip file called Magisk onto your device and you should be able to reboot after that to a rooted phone. Some people have made one-click routing methods and while I appreciate the work put into these programs, I advise you not to use them as you lose the ability to learn what you're doing to your own device. And if anything goes wrong, you won't be able to know what the program did for you to fix it. There's also one-click routing apps like Kingo Root and while those also give you root access, they don't unlock the full capabilities of routing your Android device. Enjoy!